we start with one of our chart. Just want to give a quick update. And as we can see, still we are within this down move. There is no much changes. And the price, as what we mentioned, the price break the previous low is better for us. But the is reversing is very corrective. Anyway, if we refer to the indicators, even based on one hour chart, we can see we have a divergence. And as well, we have based on forward chart. That's mean if we get any reversal, any opportunity for buy, still we will take it. And even we discuss about this one in relative to the next. All right. But we're looking for the reversal. And the ways reversing is very corrective. We are not going to look for the trade by reversing as a corrective. That's why we have to get the reversal as a sharp move flag of correction. Or if we want to put our entry, at this point, we cannot put our entry above here, at least somewhere around 0 0.225 or 23 cent. All right. Having entry at either at the 23 or at 0 0.225 any of this level in case the price reverses as a short move. That's why I mentioned if the price reverses as a, we need to see the reversal as a short move by having entry above any of the stop. If the price tag, if this is not moving, we shouldn't keep the trade more than two hours. Uh, but if the price reverses as a corrective move, we are not going to keep the trade either as a short move flag or correction or having entry in, at any of the stop, all right? And whenever we see this kind of the correction, if the price drop, then we can put our entry at 22 cent. But at this point, we cannot put it here. By the way, the way is reversing is very corrective, but as we discussed, we're looking for the reversal and we're looking for the trade for buy. And if we move to daily chart, we're looking at this correction in relative to this. That's why if we, uh, if we get any opportunity, any reversal, we'll take it. And even we can expect the price drop to 18 or 19 with the breakout of the 19, we can expect the price even drop to the 15, all right? We don't, need, we don't need to wait for the price to retest or tag the previous low before we get the reversal. Any opportunity for buy, we will take it. And with the breakout of the 36, we can look for 41 and 48. This is what we discuss every time. That's mean if we get any opportunity for buy, we will take it based on lower time frame. But we should know that maybe we get a few uh, trade setup, but it doesn't move in our direction. Every time you get the trade setup for buy, we will take it. If it's moving, we keep the trade. If not, we take out the trade because the reasons we try to get most of the trade and we, tr should, we should know how to manage because whenever we see this kind of the corrective move, when it starts to reverse, the reversal can be really sharp. Even sometimes it doesn't give us a really good opportunity to look for buy. All right. That's why we want to get the trade. We try to get as much, I mean, most of the trade setup. And if it's moving, if it's not moving our direction, we should know how to manage it because we want to get the trade at the really the best price. And simply we cannot buy and just let it go because we mentioned even we can expect the price to retest and tag 15. That's why we don't want to buy if we do the trade setup. All right. And if we move to forward chart, as we can see, the price read broke the previous low and it's still, I mean, if you refer to the indicators, we see we have a divergence. That's mean any opportunity for buy from now, we'll take it. And as a short term, we can look for breakout of 25, 26, 0 0.275, following by 29. And this is as a short term, if you get any reversal. By the way, based on forward chart, I don't see any trade setup. And if you move to one hour chart, we discuss how we can look for trade. But mostly whenever we see this kind of the corrective move, we can expect the price to drop. We need to see the reversal at least similar to what we get here, All right? Unless we get the sharp move flag correction, we take the trade. Anyway, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.